expecting a live audience on this one to run away. <laughs> but um, I'm really uh, happy to be here today. Um, I have to give you a little bit of a flashback since I'm a, a film girl, um, which is that, you know, uh, I'm really lucky. I, I grew up uh, with this incredible grandmother and mother and this lovely family who obviously did really amazing things because of whom I inherited amazing relationships. Bro, bro. Um, and as a little girl, I would go to Hyderabad for my summer holidays. And um, Mishka and all were in a bigger class and doing serious things while not quite, also talking about boys a lot. And it was also, it was very exciting for me. So I always wanted to hang with them and I wanted to hang in Bhubani Masi's house because Bhubani Masi gave me lovely, yummy khana, a lot of love, told me lots of stories and there were lots and lots of dogs and cats in that house. Uh, and a lot of the stories in Joy Mamu's book, I also inherited Joy Mamu, thanks to <laughs> thanks to these lovely people. So I inherited a Mamu. Um, and um, a lot of the stories in Joy Mamu's book, uh, I've heard from Bhubani Masi. <laughs> because I would go running off to her, because she was such a good storyteller, like my grandmother and mother. And I would say, tell me a story. And she would tell me stories from uh, this home that we saw this beautiful film about and from their lives and from their childhood and uh, about uh, various uncles and aunts and it was all so mesmerizing uh, and I have repeated those stories too. I don't know if the details of those stories are correct but now I can correct them because I have this book and I have to say that I enjoyed reading it so much I read a little bit today um, uh, because it's literally how Joy Mamu talks and it makes it so much fun and so many of the stories are familiar to me, including Trikal, which is about, which was filmed in my Bua's house uh, in Goa, uh, Mario Miranda's house. So I kind of sort of, I mean, I of course wasn't around then, but it, these are all things that I kind of have some kind of connection to. So I really enjoyed it so much, Joy Mamu. Uh, I hope lots of people read it and enjoy it. Thank you, Aditi. Tara will come up now and present a, a bouquet to Aditi. I have to also tell you that Joy Mamu has said a number of pleases and thank yous to me and I told him a thousand times that he doesn't have to. <laughs> and now this, I'm really embarrassed but thank you so much. Thank you very much, Aditi, for being here with us. And the rest, I hope I'll be friend by the end of this evening. And uh, the issue. So, earlier when you used to open the Times of India, you would read R.K. Lakshman. So now when we open Facebook, we need joy. He really makes our day we get up in the smile. And a lot of us need that because life is relentless. We need to smile. Thank you. So uh, are you going to just say thank you or we going to have a bit of fun? <laughs> Correct me if I am wrong. I think there's a lot of PG loves and influence on me. Yes, there is something wrong. And uh, what else do you mean? I have stopped reading for the last 10 years. I said I stopped reading for the last 10 years. So all my memories of actually childhood reading, I'm growing up and in it like Agatha Christie, nothing ever very serious. I never read. Uh, Oh, I, I worked my way through one Russian novel and I vowed I'd never read it. Uh, my father was mad about Russia and Russians, so I felt duty bound to make an effort. Um, and uh, the, actually the only non-fiction book I remember reading uh, was a film uh, for a book called The Ra Expeditions by Thor here that and it was fascinating, but my exams were coming up, and I knew that I should. So I kept the book in the loop, and I read one chapter a day, and I finished it, and my exam started, but I'll never forget that book. 
was absolutely amazing. Um, but I won't go into the description of it, but anyway, yeah. So I am not reading either now. Um, not, not, sorry? Not reading anymore. <laughs> no, unless you read, you can't read. I read, I read my own posts. Yes. And I, I check how many likes there are. <laughs> and I, I have to confess, I hardly ever read anyone else's <laughs> So they're very offended most of the time. But I've written it on Facebook. I said, oh yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Too embarrassing. So I told you I'm not reading anymore. And yeah. unless you read, you can't write. Yeah. But I've been managing quite well. <laughs> the other thing is, writers should be read, not seen or heard. Oh my goodness, should I go up the stairs? No, <laughs> so in Hindi there's a phrase, Dil ke tukde huye haza hai, Koi yaha gira, koi maha gira. So I feel that way about your writing, you know. I feel as if you split yourself in these different essays, vignettes, whatever you like to call them. Split? Yes, like no. if I put them all together, mm -hmm. I'll get to know who joy is. Would anyone take so much trouble? <laughs> <laughs> Anybody out there who's taking the trouble to know joy? Only oh, four hands. Come on. So, but don't force them to <laughs> Please. Don't do that. So from what I've gathered, and this is simplifying it, it's family, friends, food, and films. Uh, family, food, friends, and films. What about my sardis? <laughs> Yeah. Sure. Well, I do. The problem with me is I only do what I like, and that makes sometimes life difficult because you have to do many things you don't like. So, yeah, life is tough. But do you smile as much as you make others smile? <laughs> Question. I'm smiling, no? Yeah. I'm smiling. I shall. Ask me something else. <laughs> <laughs> so the mic is on. Why? Uh, the mic is on. You can hear both of them. I'm supposed to hear both of them. He said he was forgotten what he was going to ask, so I said, ask me something else. Okay. <laughs> Silent whisper. <laughs> Silent whisper. <laughs> yeah. After reading what you've written, I feel like being at myself. Yeah, because so much is uh, common. You, I, I read you laugh at funerals sometimes. <laughs> so do I. And I tell you, I'll give you one incident why I laugh. I gone for this funeral, and when I was going there to pay my respects, the wife told her husband, "Stop crying, these crocodile tears." <laughs> Are you serious? I'm serious. <laughs> And I just couldn't have to stuff my mouth with a kerchief. <laughs> and the other thing I feel similar was uh, you saying that your teacher and your cousin introduced you to the love for books. Yes, yes, absolutely. So I had a teacher also, Mrs. Rao, who led me by my hand and took me to the library. And she said, I see very good one. The teacher then did me my love for books. She taught me how to read. Yeah, that first, first line was the jab. Bandra boy. <laughs> so it's wonderful. I said I'm a Bandra boy, so it's wonderful. And it's wonderful to have Aditi here. Aditi, tell us about your experience with the Bandra boy and the book. So like I was saying earlier, um, I think because of my family and my grandmother and, and mother and uh, the lives they have lived and the wonderful things they have done, I've inherited some lovely relationships. And one such is, uh, I've inherited a Mamu, Joy Mamu. And um, I'm here, of course, because it's Joy Mamu, but I'm also here because I really enjoyed reading this. Um, I've heard so many stories in my childhood about their home, about the things that happened to various aunts and uncles, and, and to Joy Mamu, and to um, his sisters. Uh, and of course, the legacy of Bimal Roy, and the family, and the films. Uh, and it's just such an exciting and interesting world. And uh, Ramblings of a Banter Boy actually takes you into that world. Uh, there are little, little stories from you know various people's lives and all tie in to him. Uh, and I think that's what makes it really exciting because it's also how he speaks. Uh, and I think that's what's most fun about it because it's not uh, 
it's not difficult to read. It's a lot of fun. It's like somebody is telling you a story about something that happened. Uh, and it's very real and maybe it's because of his movie background but when you read it you you can literally see it you it, it seems like you're watching a little episode you know from a show <laughs> it's it's a lot of fun i really really enjoyed it thank you thank you so much uh, anything else you would like to add? She said a lot already. Yeah, I actually did. She said a lot. I think that's fine. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Samina. Congratulations.